biggest hit of the year featured the year's biggest star, the Saturday Night Fever King John Travolta, the movie's hottest singing and dancing star to hit the screen since Fred Astaire and Gene Kelly. Music was certainly key to the success of Grease. The album was almost as big a hit as the movie. The movie sold the songs, and the songs sold the movie, like this one from the beginning of the film. What did you do this summer, Sandy? Oh, I spent most of it at the beach. I met a boy there. You hauled your cookies all the way to the beach for some guy? Well, he was sort of special. <laughs> there ain't no such thing. He was really romantic. Oh, come on. Come on. You don't want to hear all the horny details. Are you kidding okay? me? well-edited, beautifully choreographed musical number. Now, the film was as light as a bubble. It had nothing to do with the original concept of the play, which was about tough kids on Chicago's northwest side. Well, in the movie, it was just a golden Hollywood fantasy about the 50s. I didn't think Grease was particularly interesting when Travolta was off the screen. Some of the sets were sloppy, but kids liked it enough to see it again and again and again. And their repeated viewings made Grease a monster hit. You know, friends of mine have teenage kids and these kids had memorized the musical numbers. They knew how to dance it and talk it. They had to see it a half a dozen times to be able to do that. I saw it three times myself. You want to hear a song? I think I could join you. I saw it three okay, times, you'd too. You'd be Olivia Newton-John. No, okay. no. <laughs> okay.